Now, mind you, I've tried this once, maybe twice before. I'm 99.9% .9 sure I'm going to have to trim the inner edge off of this, and today I'm going to do that. But I want to go ahead and show you. So I've put my magnetic liner on. It's been about 15 or 20 minutes. It doesn't typically take this long. But I just wanted to make sure. Now y'all make sure to save these videos because you'd be like, man, I remember that woman took her 20 minutes to put a damn eyelash on her eyeball. She can put that on in five seconds straight now. So now you can see I'm kind of struggling. Now I want you to see how long it is. So I'm going to go ahead and do the other one real quick. I probably shouldn't do this on video, but it is what it is. I am who I am. For me personally, this is not an everyday lash that I would wear. So these are our wonder lashes. So now do you see the difference? Rather than coming at the eyelash all jacked up crazy, I start on the inner corner. Now I'm not completely adhered because I don't want to be completely adhered right at the moment. But if you can see how long it is, and it is amazing. I'm going to go ahead. And I'm going to take my little itty bitty scissors. Okay, do you guys see this? See this super? Okay, see right here? I'm just barely, can you see that? Cutting that much off. All right, now. Now my daughter has told me that I need to put mascara on to make these adhere or to blend together. Again, I've not done that because I am new at this, but I want you guys to see. Chickens are hatched, people 
Now, introducing Thermalworks UPAC, a hospital trusted hygiene kit for those suffering from recurring urinary tract infections. Available in the feminine care aisle at your pharmacy. We're stuck at home just like you. What are we going to do inside with six breasts of girls? See, I get nervous dibbling around my eyes, and I, like I said, I'm new at this. Oh, there they go now, the magnets. Now, last time when I wasn't videoing, I got these on in like less than a minute. Hey guys, I just gave up. I don't have time to keep doing this today. My magnified lashes went on wonderfully. These, they're just being a nightmare. You know what? You have days like that. So, we're putting some mascara on and we're about to call it a day. You can see my eyelashes are all clumped and I have to separate them out. Da -da -da. That's lip sense. Don't need that. Don't want that. Oh, I forgot to put my eyeshadow on. So let's do that super fast. Now next week, I'll have my magna lash, magnify lashes and my magic liner, so I'll be able to do both, and then we'll do it then. I'm using my Urban Decay for my lovely little daughter and naked. Love the mats.
almost done here. My poor daughter-in-law. She's like my daughter. God love her. She is over here like this woman. Thank you, Jesus. Our poor baby got four shots today. And he's teething. And as you can hear, not a peep. But you know what? She don't know. That's a trick. Because his daddy was the same damn way. And I'm going to tell you what. Them other boys. Woo wee. If I'd have had one of them first, I probably would have stopped. I sharpened that too long, but worse things could happen. I'm going to smudge it. I'm trying to rush, and you see how that works out. One of the depart or department stores. This is the Bambi mascara. So I'm getting this on. I typically would have a oversized safety pin to comb out my eyelashes to separate them, but instead I'm just gonna comb through with this. But you'll have enough time to figure out what you want to eat by now, huh? So the reason I put the mascara on and then combed it is I didn't want to pull in my lashes. That way it was wet. It would help soften up and separate them. That's from improperly removing your eye makeup. I cannot wait, Rain Beauty. I've already ordered some. I'll have some in stock, but needless to say, if history is any indicator of how things are gonna go, when Rain Beauty launches our 3D mascara, it's gonna fly off the shelves. And I better not catch y'all buying it and selling it on eBay for triple the price because that's what some people really will do. Well, I did a little trick here that you may or may not know. When you go and you want some length, you want to take your brush and you want to shimmy your ends. Now, I don't want to comb these, but they need to be separated, and I would use a safety pin. So I'll find something along those lines here to do that with when I shut this video down here in about five minutes. So I'm going to touch up my eyeshadow, do my bottom liner, and we're going to call this a day. I don't feel like touching up where I got that back there, so I'm just touching over it.
So I don't really like how this looks on this side, on the right side where I use the eyebrow liner. So I'm adding the pomade to this side. You always want just a little dab so that you can have a, a nice clean line coming down. Yeah, it's much better. I don't like a line, so I'll take contour and even that up. And that, my friends, is a wrap. So make sure to follow me on Facebook, hit the notifications, the three little dots, and hit on and follow so you'll know when I do start going live. This is just doing the videos, and I'm also going to be posting these videos on YouTube. So I'm going to get dressed, and then you'll see me and my baby's going live later on the beach because you got to see my handsome grandbaby. And my reason why is him, my daughter in law, and my kids. Love you guys. Stay gorgeous.